Hi, I'm Mike, I'm very much a child of the 80s. A couple of weeks ago I posted a help video in regards to a USB capture device I was using and uh, I was having some issues with it flickering and the screen didn't seem to be timing up correctly and it was flickering green <clears throat> and it had only happened with one cassette and the other cassettes I'd tried seemed to have worked okay so I thought it was an issue with some sort of macro protection or something to do with the fact that it was the video was causing an issue was a camcorder video so my dad gave me this tip and said can you have a go at converting this for me again it was a camcorder one I thought great we're going to have another problem and sure enough we did but it didn't happen straight away after about five or six minutes it started flickering and going green like the previous one so I have a feeling that the issue was with the actual USB capture device. Now, the reason I knew that the video was playing okay was because I had a splitter, a SCART splitter connected to my video to enable me to take off the yellow, red, green plugs that these devices need. And that was playing fine, but it was flickering on the PC. So I thought, that's the problem. Now I have a feeling that the issue was indeed this device. So I thought, I'm gonna. The, the reason I bought a cheap one was to see if I could do it, was just to have a go and see if it would work and then go from there. And I had a feeling that, that, that with this device was a problem. So I put my hand in my pocket and I bought this one, which was the Elgato. If you Google VHS to DVD convert sort of things, this comes up as a really good one. And do you know what? It fixed the problem straight away. So I have a feeling that had I let those other videos play that were converting okay, I think one of them was Ghost, I think we'd be recorded off the TV. The chances are that one would have also started encountering this flickering issue quite quickly into the conversion. The fact that the one that was used, recorded by a camcorder, started doing it straight away, probably had something to do with timing. But regardless of that, I think it would have started doing it straight away because this one that my dad recorded initially started working fine and then started flickering. So the chances are that the other conversions that I thought were working fine would have probably done the same thing. So that needs to go in the bin and that is what you need guys don't mess about don't be tight put your hand in your pockets and buy one of these and it'll do the job straight away thanks for watching see you again